Grandma and Grandpa Transgender in the Trailer Park. Yeehaw! <laughs> Hello, y'all. I'm Diana Brienne. Sex change in the trailer park. Well, well, well. I don't give advice, suggestions, information, recommendations. I do share with you my sense of humor. Okay? Well, well, well. What's What am I talking about today? Well, as many of you know, I grew up a little while in the trailer park. And this all happened when I was probably about six or seven years old. And I did another video called Sex Change in the Trailer Park. Now, the reason I call it Sex Change and not Transgender Surgery is because back then there was no term transgender or transsexual. It was just called sex change. And even that was unheard of and only seen on the third or fourth page of a tabloid. That was it. And so in the other video, I talked about how um, this wonderful woman moved into the trailer park and she was a what was called a sex change back then. Well, lo and behold, let's fast forward that story. And if you don't know that story, go back and watch that video. Well, the church lady lived in one trailer and she was very church lady like. And isn't that special? <laughs> And then on the other side was the naked woman and her naked boyfriend with the husband that chased the naked boyfriend down the street. So if you haven't watched that video, you've got to go back and look at that one. And anyhow, on the other side of the trailer was the, the um, what they called the sex change. Well, lo and behold, let's fast forward a few years. And um, uh, someone new moved into the trailer park. Well... What was called the sex change, the sex change lady, and she is a wonderful, wonderful woman. She um, she met and married a man. Well, the man turned out to also have underwent what is now known as transgender, transsexual surgery, and was a grandpa, was now a grandpa, and she was a grandma. So they kind of did the big switch. They kind of went in reverse of each other, I guess it is. And so they got married. They actually got married. They were both people who had undergone trans, what's now called transgender surgery. This is back in the early 1960s. And so they were called the sex change grandpa and grandma of the trailer park. And they were absolutely amazing and wonderful. And everybody loved and embraced them. And this is way, way, way back in the day before any of this was talked about, before there was any talk shows, before there was any information, before people were educated on the, on the topic, before there was even a name for it. And this occurred way back then. And from what I can remember, they were wonderful. Well, the church lady, she was sure busy. She had the naked lady on the other side with the naked boyfriends. And then now she had the grandma and grandpa on the other side. Boy, I tell you, I bet she really had her work cut out for her. <laughs> And so that trailer park was just really, really something. It really was. We had the women who had the wiggle walk and the high heels and the pantyhose club. And oh my goodness, we had so many stories from that trailer park. But yes, I do remember the grandma and the grandpa. And they both had done what, what they both went in opposite directions. And one became the grandma and one became the grandpa. And they got married. And from what I know, they lived happily ever after. And people were wonderful to them. And that's the way it should be. From my house to yours, may God bless you. I hope you like, share, subscribe. And I do hope you keep your sense of humor. Hope to talk. Talk to you then. Bye-bye.